Hi, it's me, Leandra Medine, formerly of Ask a Man If He Likes My Outfit in Bryant Park. Today we're in Washington Square Park offering free advice at the discounted rate of free. Reasons I believe I'm qualified to give free advice are this polo. When have you ever had reason not to trust someone wearing a polo? The shoes on my feet, which are fur-lined in spite of the 88-degree August day with which we have been blessed. And finally, these ice-colored lenses. Because if you can't trust someone who's going to see the world through rose-colored lenses, you can rest assured that someone in ice-colored lenses is going to give it to you real. Welcome to the free advice station, guys. What can I help you with? So we're kind of dressed casually right now, but if we had to like jet to the White House, how could we change up our look in like five minutes? You're going to the White House? I needed a comfortable man shoe, right? Not a hard bottom shoe, not leather. Have you considered the pumps of Manolo Blahnik? I did. They're not flattering for size 12D on men, unless you're a drag queen, which there's nothing wrong with that. Um, Call me. My girlfriend's kind of crying, but my friend wants to go out drinking tonight with me. So I'm thinking if I should actually console her or just go get flat out drunk for no fucking reason. You're probably not in the right relationship. You should do her a service and let her know that she's breaking up with you. I never actually thought about it that way. Oh my God, I should just, I, she needs to break up with me. I can't, be, uh, thank you so much. I wouldn't have known that I would have to do that right now. You're welcome, enjoy your eggs. Thank you so, so much. So long, farewell, afiraze to you. See that, saving women, one bag of eggs at a time. What can I help you with? Well, me and, me and Jamie are from Canada, and she just moved to New York, so what would be your best advice for her? I would say get a tuna sandwich. How young is too young to get like a car loan for a car? What do you want a car for? Are you trying to escape? Of course. What do I do if I go in for a hug and they just want to do a handshake? I have to do this a lot with kissing because there's a lot of like double, single, triple shit happening and I never know if I'm supposed to go in for the figure skater triple or the standard one. So you're coming in for the hug, I'm going in for the handshake. I would just say that you you are like fell swoop it. Like handshake. all the way? Mm -hmm. Like just go in? Bad. Bad. Mm -hmm. No. Now you're gonna come in half handshake, half hug. Okay. okay. So, hi. See that? That works. Yes. Perfect. <laughs> what do I do when I go out? I don't know. Smarty pants. I'm. At, what do you do when you go out? Uh, you tell me, Mr. Market Research Backpack Man. Uh, would you ever consider going to City Hall and changing your name to Mortimer? I would not. Why doesn't my boyfriend text me back? How long have you been dating? 13 months. And you're calling him a boyfriend in spite of the fact that he's not texting you back? Yes. How frequently do you see him? Every day. How do you connect if he's not writing you back? It's complicated. I think this seems like a classic case of beautiful girl unaware of her beauty, trapped in relationship with ugly man, unaware of his ability to use opposable thumbs. All hail the women with opposable thumbs and the ability to use them. So if you had to prioritize your three favorite activities, they would be sex, then walking, then talking. Exactly, yes. And in that order. That's just tremendous. Ask not what the city can do for you, but what I can do for the city. No, but what fun can do for inside your pants. Ah, okay, interesting, thank you. Woo! <laughs> Do you know how to jump rope? I know how. I could probably do two. Two jumps? Like two jumps. So if I were you, I would aim toward 10. Get to 10. And then? And then 11. I'm planning to go on vacation soon. And I'm not quite sure where I should go. You got any ideas? Well, first things first. Vacation, my friend, is a state of mind. Do ah. you think I should take off my shirt and suntan? I would. I did. You look great. That's joie de vivre, man. I've got joie de vivre and a certain je ne sais quoi. Why are you still here? 
Leandra, I have a little bit of a conundrum. I'm not sure if I should take a train to New Jersey this evening or wait for my husband to leave at 4 o'clock and sit in midtown traffic with him. Well, Leandra, what are the upsides of taking the train? Well, you know, if I take the train, I'll have some time to myself. I'll think about things. I'll be able to talk to myself. You know, really, really narrate my dream. Sounds like we both know what you need to do. I don't know what you're talking about. If I were you, and as fate and your life would have it, I am you, I would do neither of those things. Instead, hop on a plane and head to, oh my god, I know where this is going, Romania.